All right. Good afternoon again, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for joining us today and for taking the time to attend this webinar, Explore the Pacasha Samiria National Reserve. My name is Ana Kammerer. I'm based in Buenos Aires, Argentina, and I work for Emerging Destinations. We are a sales and marketing representation company in US and Canada. Today, I will be your co-host, and in a few more seconds, I will introduce our guest, Rosanna Guinea. As you will see in a few moments on your screen, uh, Emerging Destinations has a big, diverse and adventure portfolio. In Central and South America, we have Terra Nova Tours in Costa Rica. We represent the Guyana Tourism Authority. We also have Hotel Torres and Fantastico Sur in Torres del Paine National Park in Chile. Also in Patagonia, we have Cruz de Andino, who is the famous lake crossing in Northern Patagonia, uh, as well as our host today, Jungle Experiences on the Peruvian Amazon and Grand Hotel Lats in Argentina and Uruguay. In Africa, we are proud of representing Kelly and Peacock Safaris, the Elewana Collection and Sky Safari, all of those doing Kenya and Tanzania. We also have eco training uh, in South Africa and then adventure consults in Uganda and Rwanda. Lastly, our polar products in the portfolio is completed with Iceland Pro Cruises, Iceland Pro Travel and Adventure Canada. We are really very happy of having these cool companies in cool places with us. If you have any questions or maybe need a brochure, um, or digital material, please feel free to send me an email after the webinar. You can see my email address at the bottom of your screen now. Before starting with the webinar, I would love to give you a few housekeeping items to go over for GoToWebinar. All attendees will be mute and this webinar is being recorded. So if you have to answer the phone or need to do a break, don't worry about that. We will be sending you the playback later by email, most prob probably by the end of this week. We will also upload this recording on our new YouTube channel, Emerging Destinations. We encourage you sending any questions. You can do that on the GoToWebinar control panel on your right. Rosanna Guinea from Jungle Experiences and myself, we will be answering them either at the end of the presentation today or by email at the end of this week. So let's start with our webinar. Please help me welcome Ms. Rosanna Guinea, Director of Sales and Marketing at Jungle Experiences. Good evening to all our friends in the travel industry. Um, I imagine you are listening from home in USA and Canada. Thank you for your time and interest in learning about the Peruvian Amazon and Jungle Experiences Amazon River Cruises. My name is Rosana Guinea and I am the Sales and Marketing Director at Jungle Experiences. Today, I will give you some useful information about the Amazon rainforest, the Bacaya Samaria National Reserve in Peru, and why is it so rewarding to decide to visit this unexplored side of the world on board a cruise ship? Please, please relax and enjoy the webinar. Feel free to ask any questions by chat during the webinar, and I will be more than happy to answer them at the end of this presentation. Let's start with how do we get to the Peruvian Amazon rainforest? As you all know, the COVID-19 crisis has forced many countries to temporarily close its international borders. In Peru, we are hopeful that international flights will reopen by the end of August. Once the tourism industry is restored, the best way to visit Peru is to take flights. From Canada, there are four direct flights every week from Toronto to Lima with Air Canada. And from USA, we have a total of 89 direct flights from Atlanta, Newark, 
Houston, Los Angeles, Miami, New York, Orlando, Dallas, and Fort Lauderdale. Delta, um, United, LATAM, and American Airlines, and also JetBlue and Spirit are the airlines uh, that do this, this flight. Once you arrive in Lima, then you take a one and a half hour flight from Lima to Iquitos, the capital of Loreto region, the only city in the world which is inaccessible by road since it is surrounded by the Amazon River. And here is where your adventure begins. Now, I will introduce you to the Amazon, which is the largest rainforest drained by the mightiest river in the world, the Amazon River. Seven countries are all part of the Amazon Basin, including Peru, Brazil, Colombia, Ecuador, Guyana, Suriname, and Venezuela. It is important to mention that the origin of the Amazon River starts in the Andes Mountains of Peru, at the west of the basin, with its main tributary, the Marañón River. Thus, the highest point in the watershed of the Amazon is the peak of Yerupaja at 21,000 feet in west central Peru in Ancash, Bolognese province. And inside the Peruvian Amazon, you will find the Pacaya Samaria National Reserve. Pacaya Samaria is located between rivers Ucayali and Marañón. It is the biggest natural reserve in the Amazon with an extension of 2,080,000 hectares. It houses 27% of the flora and fauna on earth. It is the most pristine flood forest in the world a privileged area waiting to be discovered by travelers. It is home for more than 200 local communities, small towns with around 120,000 people each. Pacaya Samiria is also known as the Jungle of Mirrors because of the effect that the shining sun has on the river dark waters, actually creating a mirror that is shown beautifully on pictures. The Pacaya Samaria National Reserve is home to the most amazing animal and plant species. Species that inhabit the Amazon and its shores accompanying us throughout our expedition on a cruise through the Amazon. Scientists have registered the presence of 527 birds, 102 mammal species, 69 species of reptiles, 58 amphibians, 269 different kinds of fish, and right now, 1,024 species of wild or domesticated plants, including the famous Victoria regia or water lilies. And just a few of the endangered species that traveler might encounter during one of our excursions on our skiffs into the wilderness are, as shown on this slide, the Huatzin, believed to be a prehistoric bird, the sloth, the black caiman, the pink river dolphin, the little lion monkey, and the giant river otter. And why exploring the Amazon River on a cruise is the best way to do it? Boarding one of our cruises, the traveler will get to know the Amazon in a unique and unforgettable way. It is the perfect blend between adventuring in the jungle and enjoying the best comfortable service. Passengers are guided on a magical journey of discovery, encountering wildlife and learning about native communities, being able to really embrace nature throughout the way since during every moment of their day, they are able to enjoy amazing views of the river and landscape. Feel the breeze from the cruise observation deck, encounter exotic living species from the skiffs and experience the Amazon directly during the Amazon walks. Our cruises were created in order to take the traveler further, bringing us closer to pristine and unexplored places which retain all their original magic. And on our skiffs, we are able to navigate 
further in the river affluents, where close encounters with wildlife and nature are more likely and rewarding. Why jungle experiences? With more than 25 years of experience in the Amazon rainforest, jungle experiences owned three Amazon River cruises, including Safiro, La Perla, and Amatista. On this presentation, I will focus on Safiro and La Perla. Jungle Experiences is part of Grupo Dorado, a business group based in Iquitos that owns several companies in the tourism industry, such as Double Tree by Hilton Iquitos Hotel, the only five star hotel in the city, as well as two more hotels and an entertainment nightclub. Let me introduce you to Safiro our luxury boutique cruise with a capacity for 40 passengers. It has a total of 19 suites. On our first deck, you will find eight standard suites that are 226 square feet, feet and have panoramic windows. These are, these are spacious suites with beautiful views that can be converted into connecting rooms, ideal for families. On the second deck, you will find eight suites that are 226 square feet with private balconies, a space to enjoy the trip in a unique way. On our first deck at the bow of the cruise, we have two master suites that are 248 square feet and offer 90 degree angle views. On our second deck at the bow of the ship is our star suite, the Sapphire suite. This is the most luxurious suite in the Amazon. It measures 474 square feet and offers 180 degree angle views. It has a private balcony and jacuzzi tub. All suites are properly equipped with air conditioning, twin beds, convertible to Californian king beds, private bathroom with Spanish shower, hot water, desk, luggage rack, amenity kit, exotic fruit-based amenities, hair dryer, safe, mini frigo bar, and internal telephone. All the beds have sheets of Peruvian 100% Pima cotton. The Safiro's interior, interior lounge area has everything you need to recover after an intense day of excursions through the Amazon jungle. It is comfy to rest and take a break. It is decorated with local crafts by the indigenous communities of the area. Featuring large windows with views of the Amazon, this space becomes ideal to continue discovering. The sofas with exterior views are an ideal setting to read, rest and relax without meeting, missing any detail of what is happening outside. There is a variety of books to choose from about Peru. The bar is in this same space, where the traveler can savor the most exotic cocktails in the region, including Pisco Sour, of course, and enjoy the party with live music and dancing by our crew. Peruvian cuisine is recognized as one of the best in the world. The three regions of the country are reflected in its recipes, the coast, the highlands, and the jungle in addition to a fusion of influences from different cultures. Traveling on Safiro, you will enjoy a variety of flavors every day that include Oriental, Italian, International, Amazonian, and fusion styles, always made with local products. Safiro's dining room is one of the spots in the cruise where the traveler will experience the heart of the Amazon with greater intensity. It welcomes a traveler with its panoramic windows and relaxed atmosphere. During breakfast and lunch, and also dinner, a la carte menu is served. Safira cuisine showcases flavors and foods 
extracted from the Amazon jungle. Exotic fruits and species play an essential role in the gastronomic proposal of the cruise. The traveler will be able to find lighter and or vegetarian options as well. And this is our observation deck and solarium where the traveler can be caressed by the Amazon breeze, enjoy the immense views of the river, and, sh and share moments of rest outdoors on our observation deck. The cushion deck chairs are super comfortable. The outdoor bar located in this aim area will allow the traveler to enjoy the most refreshing cocktails at the best time of day. The outdoor jacuzzi is the perfect setting for watching the sunset in the Peruvian jungle. An excellent option to end the day with a bubbly bath. We offer private romantic dinners upon request. In the massage room on board Safiro, the traveler can enjoy relaxing treatments such as aromatherapy or a therapeutic massage. Our wellness specialists can also adapt to the schedule and needs of each client, providing them with massage services in their own suite. The Firo also features an exercise room some of our sporty travelers find very useful. And now, let me introduce you to La Perla. This is our adventure cruise with a capacity for 28 passengers. This cruise is thought for a traveler that wants to immerse in the heart of the Amazon jungle with comfort, reaching the most amazing and magical spots in the rainforest. With a total of 14 cabins, on our first and second deck, you'll find our nine standard cabins, which are 150 square feet and offer exterior windows. On our second day of the bow of the cruise, there are two Amazon View cabins. These cabins are 124 square feet, offer exterior windows and a shared balcony. On our first, an observation deck, we have three superior cabins that are 215 square feet, offer exterior windows and a private balcony as well. This cabin is ideal for families, since it is possible to include an additional bed. All cabins in La Perla are equipped with air conditioning, a private bathroom and shower with hot water 24 hours a day. They also have a desk, wardrobe, dresser, hair dryer, and amenities. This is our indoor lounge, reading room, and bar. It is an ideal meeting point for travelers who wish to take a break on their adventure along the Amazon. An air conditioning space that allows you to keep track of what is happening around you, thanks to the large windows that offer spectacular views of the landscape. In this area, you can find books that will help you get to know the Amazon and its surroundings even more. The bar offers exclusive cocktails made from exotic fruit from the Amazon jungle itself, as well as other typical drinks from the area. La Perla's dining room is where the traveler can enjoy a mix of flavors from around the world, from traditional Peruvian dishes to Oriental, Italian, and American options, all prepared with fresh products from the region. This dining room has large windows so the traveler does not lose sight of what happens outside during lunchtime, creating an experience that combines flavors with spectacular views. Uh, our outdoor lounge area is perfect for relaxing and having a drink, enjoying the nice view and weather. And this is La Perla's hammock area. The rocking of the boat on the waters of the river will take you to a feeling of absolute tranquility while the Amazonian air caresses your skin. And let me present you our crew. 
all of the people that are part of jungle experiences share a deep love and respect for the Amazon, its landscape and its people. We also share a strong commitment to the professionalism and care of the experience of our passengers. And now let's talk a little bit about the weather. The Amazon River Basin has a low water season and a high water or wet season, during which the river floods the adjacent low-lying forest. Dry season runs from June to October. At this time, the climate is drier and the low water levels attract creatures that can hardly be seen in the rainy season. The flow of the river decreases in this period, revealing surprising sandy beaches, an ideal time to stroll through the forest and discover the Amazonian flora and fauna. Wet season runs from November to May. This time of year is marked by rains and storms. It is in these months when most plants bloom or bear fruit, drawing a unique spectacle. Birds and primates are drawn to this spectacle and can be seen on the banks of the river. The climate of the basin is generally hot and humid. The average annual temperature is around 77 degrees Fahrenheit, with no distinction between summer and winter season. And now let me explain a little bit about our itineraries. Our Safira cruise offers three options, seven night uh, itinerary, a four night itinerary, and a three night itinerary. Itineraries in, in Safira include a one night stay at Double Tree by Hilton Iquitos, lunch before boarding at Double Tree by Hilton Iquitos, all meals on board, all excursions and equipment, transfer from and to the ship upon arrival, entrance to the Pacaya Samaria National Reserve, natural juices, sodas, infusions, water, and national alcoholic beverage during meals. We offer complimentary pisco sour as well. Our La Perla cruise also has three options that go from three nights from Sunday to Wednesday, three nights from Wednesday to Saturday, Saturday, or six nights from Sunday, Sunday to Saturday. All meal, meals are included on board La Perla. Also, all excursions and equipment, including hiking boots and ponchos, transfers from and to the ship upon arrival on recommended flight to Quitos, transfers from hotels in the city of Iquitos, entrance fee to the Bacaya Samaria National Reserve, and also natural juices, coffee, infusions, and water is included during meals. And now let's talk about our excursions and activities. All activities are optional, although we encourage our passengers to try their adventurous side. Excursions take place two to three times a day. Our excursion boats use silencers that minimize noise pollution so as not to affect the wildlife. Travelers are not allowed to touch living species. On Safiro, we have three skiffs, two for 25 passengers and one for 20 passengers. And we also have a boat with a capacity for 50 passengers. On La Perla, we have two boats for 20 passengers each. Kayaking is the most genuine excursion of the Amazon ecosystem. The traveler will be able to discover from a close range all the species that inhabit the largest river in the world. Learning about the Amazon. Due to the COVID-19 crisis, we have momentarily suspended our visits to local communities. Instead, each afternoon, all travelers can listen to interesting lectures about the Bacaya Samiria National Reserve, the local people, its customs and tradition. In our commitment to sustainable and responsible tourism management, we are constantly working 
with local communities. Once a week, we visit them with non-perishable food, supplies, clothes, and shoes. As part of our work, we also work with women artisans from the San Francisco community on the Ucayali River. The artwork of these talented women is displayed on the ship as part of the decoration. We also offer handicrafts in our boutique on board, where we encourage tourists to purchase these pieces of art to contribute to this community. Piranha fishing is probably my favorite of all the excursions. We uh, offer piranha fishing this experience in lagoons, streams, and pipes, discovering the different fishing techniques used by indigenous civilizations. As part of our commitment to the environment, we exercise a strict catch and release policy. And about bird watching, it is important to say that Bacaya Samira is a paradise for bird lovers. More than 1,500 species of birds inhabit the Amazon basin, and 527 species are registered in Pacaya Samira National Reserve. During our jungle and canopy walks, our travelers will discover new animal species, learn about medicinal plants, and survival techniques directly from, from locals. One of the essential figures of the Amazonian cultures of Peru are the shamans, men and women who live by and for their community, wise and notable people of the link between human beings, spirit and nature, to whom the indigenous communities owe to a great extent its survival. The role of the shaman is essential for their community. It is they who protect and guide the people who inhabit their villages, beings with a, a higher level of consciousness that from their own experience have learned to connect with the spirits of nature. This connection allows them to heal, to access the deepest part of the, pe of the people who come to him to free them from their ailments and unmissable experience. As a result of the coronavirus new reality, we have implemented sanitary measures in all of our vessels. Our team is trained to prevent the spread of diseases on board. Cleaning and sanitation in high traffic areas such as handrails, doorknobs, and light switches will be enhanced. Antibacterial gel dispensaries will be implemented in each deck and outside the dining room. We have innovated with a new cleaning procedure using ozone gas, which is effective and healthy. Cabins will be cleaned and disinfected three times a day. Luggage will also be cleaned using ozone gas. The paramedic will have supplies to treat a variety of illnesses. We have developed a comprehensive plan that follows protocols for sanitary care. Before boarding the ship, passengers will be screened for possible flu symptoms such as cough, fever, headache, and those who present them will not be able to board our vessel. Each passenger will get complimentary masks. Moreover, we also request support from our clients by reinforcing these measures. Washing their hands frequently, covering their nose and mouth with a handkerchief, or forearm when sneezing. We have reached the end of this presentation. Remember that Peruvian Amazon awaits. Don't forget to dream now and travel later and take advantage of our flexible reservation policies. Thank you very much for listening and I am now ready to answer your questions. Thank you so much, Rosanna, for your presentation. Uh, now we are going to answer a few questions that some of the advisors have been typing on the control panel. The first one uh, is regarding the capacity of each cruise. Can you please repeat how many passengers um, 
you can hold on both Safiro and La Perla. Yes, Safiro has a capacity for 40 passengers and La Perla has a capacity for 28 passengers. Okay, thank you. Then we do have another one. Uh, let me see. Do people ever suffer from motion sickness aboard these ships? Um, not really, because uh, the experience of an Amazon River cruise an, an Amazon River cruise is much smaller than a regular cruise, you know, the big cruises where, uh, I mean, uh, it's different because it's a much sm smaller boat. So, and also the, the, the river um, has no movement at all. So, um, no, motion sickness is not something that uh, you have to worry about. Okay, thank you. Then the third question I have for you is uh, about the requirements um, that passengers will need in terms of visas, any vaccine like malaria. Can you explain a bit more about that? Yes, um, it's not mandatory, but we recommend uh, passengers to get vaccinated uh, for yellow fever. And about visas, uh, it depends on, on, on what visa, uh, I mean, on, on where are you from, basically. Well, um, uh, thinking about uh, US and Canada, I think they don't need a visa. Exactly, they don't, they don't need a visa. Okay, perfect. Uh, and you don't need to take the malaria pills? No, it's not, it's not, it's not uh, something that you need to it's not mandatory, it's not something that, that, that you must do. And uh, yeah. Okay, thank you. Then can you uh, explain a bit more about how many excursions or activities per day do you offer and if they are included on the final price or if passengers need to uh, consider any extra money for the activities? No, all the excursions are included in the package and we offer three excursions every day, three excursions a day. Okay, thank you. Um, another question we have, what is the name of the other ship you own and what type of cruising and how many packs do you carry on Amatista, which is the third ship that you mentioned at the beginning of the um, webinar? Okay, the other the other cruise uh, is called Amatista. This cruise uh, has a capacity for twenty nine passengers, and it's a historic boat. So just the build of the ship is beautiful, um, and it's made from wood. So it's a little oh. bit different. However, we are not focusing on, uh, on to explain about this cruise. Uh, in this webinar, because uh, we have uh, this uh, boat um, chartered for the following years. Okay, so the Amatista is not available. It is start chartered until uh, 2022. So I you mean, are because only... due to the coronavirus crisis, uh, we have had some cancellations. So it's probable that it will be available, but we have to check the dates um, request, I mean, each request individually. So we can let you know 100% if it's available or not. It depends on the dates. Okay, perfect. Um, it has been recently renovated as well. This cruise, uh, it's a beautiful option as well. And as far as category it would be uh, the same as La Perla. So it's like okay. a- the hours, our um, our most luxurious cruise is Safiro, and then we have La Perla and Amatis, which are great options as well. Also, the, yes. on the market, um, you won't find this level of cruise. On the market, there are, it's there is more competition on the luxury level cruises, but uh, not so much on a, on a, an adventure cruise like the ones Jungle Spirits have to offer. 
great. And my recommendation, based on my experience, that I had the, the chance to sail on both ships, uh, Safiro and La Perla, last year on last July. I could say that maybe uh, Safiro is ideal for honeymooners, for you know, for luxury passengers that want a dedicated team or some extras like the, um, the massages or special treatments on board. And then La Perla, I found it is ideal for families, for multi-generational trips. It's definitely a great option to carry the grandparents, the mom, dad, and the kids on board. It's, uh, I think that La Perla is the, the great option uh, for that type of travelers. Yes, and we also offer different type of benefits according to different segments, like a solo traveler, uh honeymooners so depending on the type of segment we have uh, some promotion yes and this was my following question someone is asking is there a single supplement um it depends on the booking type okay but you offer reduced prices for solo travelers so they yes. don't have to but to pay for the empty space on full price Exactly. Great. Uh, let me see. We have some few other questions. How many passengers per tour guide on each uh, excursions do you have? I think you have from two to three skips, isn't it? Yes, I explained on uh, on the presentation uh, the type of uh, the type of uh, boats that we have, the type of skips. Safiro has uh, two skips and one additional boat. It has more capacity, of course, because it's a bigger cruise than the Perla. Uh, and you, you usually take around 15 to 20 people on Safiro yeah. on each yeah, excursion? On, Safiro, and then... on each excursion, there are three skips, two for 25 passengers and one for 20 passengers. And then we have that boat, which is smaller, for 15 passengers. And on La Perla, we have two boats for 20 passengers each. Great, thank you. Um, I have some other questions. Um, do you have rates or special packages that already include the airfare from Lima to Iquitos? We have some, some uh, partners and we are working with them. Uh, travel agencies, um, outbound in the United States. We don't offer them directly, but we work through our partners. Travel agencies are in, in this case in USA that can, be, that can offer this type of products, including uh, uh, the international tickets. Okay. Um, it's important to mention that we will keep our rates because of the COVID-19, we have uh, made some uh, some strategic uh, decisions and we are going to keep our rates from 2020. We're not going to increase our rates for 2021 and 2022. So the same rates from 2020 will apply to 2021 and 2022. Okay, this is great news. So you are freezing the, the rates until the end of next year? Until the end of 2022, actually. Okay, yeah, great. Two more years to go. Um, the last question is, uh, the trip starts from Iquitos always? Um, right now, uh, we're, all of our, of our cruises will go from Nauta to Nauta. So to, when you arrive in Iquitos, from Iquitos to Nauta, you take a bus, a bus ride for two hours. Then you arrive in Nauta, and the, the due to the COVID um, crisis, we have uh, changed the itineraries, and now all of our itineraries depart from Nauta and arrive back in Nauta. And you provide that transfer. It is of course, it's included in the, in the rate. Yes. Be before the COVID uh, nineteen crisis, we had departures from Iquitos and from Nauta. Now all the departures are from Nauta. That's the only change, but it's included in the rate. The same. Okay. 
Great. So this is, I think, let me, let me check once again if we have any other question. No, we are done for today. So again, before the end of this week, we will be sending every advisor, every attend, attendee, um, a follow-up email uh, with useful information as well as the recording. And remember that the playback will be also available on our new YouTube channel, Emerging Destinations and on our website, emergingdestinations.com. So this is all for today's webinar, uh, Explore the Patasha Samiria National Reserve. Do you want to add something, Rosanna? Yes, I want to finish the presentation highlighting our luxury uh, suite on Safiro. This is a star suite. We consider it, uh, it's the best suite in the Amazon River cruises, really. Um, the panoramic windows are really characteristic in this suite. And it, the design is just super elegant and modern. It's really beautiful. So it's, it's a beautiful, beautiful suite and a, a really great option for, for couples or, you know, honeymoons. So we, we recommend this, this suite. Really, really nice. And it's the okay. biggest one in all the Amazon River Cruises right now. Great. Thank you very much, Rosana, for your time and for joining us, showing us this uh, beautiful trip along the Amazon River. We really, really appreciate your time and connection with us today. And again, if we can help or assist you in any way, we will be happy to do it. So do not hesitate to contact us. Remind you, my email address is Anna, A N A, at emergingdestinations.com. I hope you have a wonderful afternoon and look forward to having your clients sailing the Amazon River very soon. Thank you.